The gentleman from Tennessee. Thank you, Mr. Ison. Thank you, uh, Congressman Johnson, for, for bringing us all together today. I think that I'm the last Senate-confirmed U.S. Attorney in the House of Representatives. And the thing we all like procedures, and what we've seen over the last two years when Democrats threaten to disrupt that is, is that the rules are the rules until the rules aren't convenient. And that's one way they talk about packing the court. I think Glenn Grossman said it exactly right when he talked about our nation's history. When we hear from our constituents, they like our principles, they like the precedence. And the precedence is, historically, to keep the court, to keep the United States Supreme Court at nine justices. We need, we hear this message from our constituents, the Democrat members do too, we need to keep that precedence. We need to keep the court at nine members and this bill does exactly that, and we need to continue to send that message all across the nation. Thank you all for being here, Mr. Johnson. I'll yield back.